What is up you guys? It's Madison here and today I have my Marvel The Infinity Saga Collector's Corpse Box. This is my very first Collector's Corpse Box and I'm very excited to open it. I'm also very surprised it came today. It wasn't supposed to come until like two weeks, but it arrived today, so I will take it. I already know everything that's in here, which is kind of the reason that I got it, but I'm still super excited. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh, so there's the shirt on top and something just fell. So the first thing that jumped out of the box was the Captain Marvel pin, and I'm pretty sure this was in the dark, so I'll test that in a little bit. There is the pin a little bit closer up. Looks super cool. I actually really, really like this one. And then next we have the shirt. I got a small because I had no idea what size to get. I didn't know if I should get extra small or small. I like vary between both. Depends on the shirt, you like fit. There's that small definitely perfect peter tingle that is the funniest but cringiest thing ever and i love it so this was next in here it just says the next box is gonna be which is black widow you can get these off of amazon i think you can actually pre-order the black widow one already and then we have this decal of thor's hammer and this also glows in the dark so that's really cool i'm excited to see all this later i have never gotten a peter quill or star lord Funko pop before and i have always wanted one since like when i first started collecting pops but i have never gotten one and today is the day that i have finally gotten one but i'm gonna save the best for last so you have to wait on that one just a second so the first pop that i'm taking out of here is a black panther glow in the dark that is so cool. I know quite a few people weren't very happy with the idea of having more glow-in-the-dark Black Panther pops, but I personally think this one is really, really super cool. And then my favorite piece of this box, the Star-Lord glow-in-the-dark pop. This has to be one of my favorite pops right now. I am so excited to see this glow-in-the-dark. This is so cool. I cannot even explain how excited I am to have this now. So that was everything that was in the box. I personally think it is well worth the $30. Again, this was my first Marvel Corpse box and I'm very, very happy with what I got in it, even though I did order it because I knew what I was getting in it. But you know, I still am very happy with it. So let's go see everything glow in the dark. Okay, so we're gonna test these out to see how much they glow. First thing we're gonna see glow is the Captain Marvel pin. I'm not sure how great it's gonna show up on my phone since that's what I'm recording on, but we'll see what you guys can see. I'm just charging it up with this light. <laughs> I don't have a black light or anything, unfortunately, so this is what I've got for now. There, you can faintly kind of see it there. It's a lot more vivid in person, but yeah. Next, we're gonna do the decal which was actually already glowing when I brought it in here and it looks pretty darn cool. So let's see this one. That is cool. I'm not sure why this part right here is like that, but overall it looks really cool. So I have heard that some people's are actually not glowing, which is a little upsetting to me because I was really excited for the Star Lord one to glow. So I'm going to be a little upset if these actually don't glow, but we're here to test that out right now. Okay, let's see. Three, two, one. Uh-oh. Okay. Let's see if this one's going to glow at all. So let's try this one. No glow. These two are not glowing. So as I was editing the video, Someone had just notified me that you need a UV light in order to make the two pops glow. I do not have a UV light, at least I don't think so, but yeah. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was me opening up my Marvel Corpse box. Again, that was my very first one and I was super excited. I really like it. Definitely worth the $30, I personally think. A lot of people weren't very excited with the things that were they were getting in this box, but I personally am happy with what I got. Make sure you follow all the links down below. I'm gonna link my Funko Pop Instagram account down there too. I'm gonna be doing a birthday live stream on my birthday on the Funko Pop account, which is April 9th. So make sure you tune into that. I'll have more details coming up soon, but those will all be posted on my account there. So follow that account for more details on that. Thank you guys all for watching. Make sure you do follow those links. 
leave a like, and subscribe for more videos. Also, feel free to comment any suggestions that you guys want to see in the future. See you guys next time. Goodbye.